buying a yacht is often referred to as a purchase of passion. You know, you really do have to fall in love with a yacht in order to buy it. And different yachts have different features that are easy to fall in love with. But I'm willing to build it for my man. There are yachts that are like the girl next door. Everybody loves them because they are so innocent and sweet. Other yachts are like a sexy librarian. Beautiful, but with an inner technical depth that some yacht owners just can't get enough of. This yacht though, this yacht is different. Her name is Neoprene. <laughs> Neoprene is the girl your mother doesn't want you to meet. A leather-clad, mini-skirted biker chick with an attitude. Her bite is decidedly fiercer than her bark, as her two 4000 series MTU engines growl to the tune of 5,500 horsepower. And her Kiwi Ma jet drives hurl her through the waves at a top speed of 32 knots. Built by the Overmarine shipyard in Italy, Neoprene is a Mangusta 108 yacht, so-called because it is in fact 108 feet in length. These yachts are built for speed, for sunbathing, and for water sports. So, before we take a look at her extensive capacity to satisfy those requirements, let me take you inside for a look at her surprisingly elegant interior. Through the aft deck sliding doors, visitors to this yacht are greeted by a surprisingly fresh and airy interior. A blend of lightly colored Alcantara and limed oak cabinetry merges in a harmonic testament to Italian minimalist design. This is a lounge area that is spacious enough to relax in with friends and family in air-conditioned comfort as you enjoy some wonderful sea views through spacious and subtly shaped side windows. It is here too that the yacht's helm station is located, neatly concealed by a 55-inch television set and stylish Bang & Olufsen speakers. The equipment that you can see here on the dashboard was completely upgraded and updated in 2017. Below deck, another lounge area is situated. It's a spacious place to be, and although this is clearly a yacht that invites you to spend time outdoors, I can imagine that this is a welcome spot to unwind in the air conditioning if you want to chill out and watch a film. Off of this lounge is a guest stateroom with an ensuite bathroom. But just take a look at this wonderful full beam master stateroom. Light and airy, with plenty of windows to gift the owner with wonderful views of the surrounding seascape when he awakes in the morning. Actually, all of the interior of this yacht is a surprising contrast to her sultry black exterior, and two well-proportioned guest cabins sit forward of the master stateroom to offer enticing accommodations for friends and for family of the owner. Let's talk for a moment about those three characteristics, though, that make Mangusta yachts so desirable, starting with the sunbathing spaces. Certainly the most private area for sunbathing on Neoprene is the foredeck, where these spacious and comfortable sunbeds are situated, allowing you to soak up the sun's rays, or to enjoy a little shade if the sun becomes too harsh. 
For many, the aft deck will be the social centre of this yacht though, a wonderfully open and informal area where you and your guests can relax without the constraint of formalities. And this is certainly the area where most guests shall enjoy their meals on board, cooked of course in a very well equipped galley located below deck, but with easy access to both the inside dining table and of course the alfresco aft deck table. Now I might dream of eating and sleeping on a super yacht, but many of my clients are brimming with energy and they just can't wait to get out on the water toys. So water toy storage is an important consideration for a yacht like this. And here, neoprene absolutely excels. The entire transom of neoprene is the stuff that water sports enthusiasts dream of. It opens up to become an inviting water level beach club that is brimming with water toys, including five sea bobs, two rigid kayaks, an inflatable kayak, two paddle boards, a lazy boy pontoon, and these cavernous side lockers that were actually built to accommodate jet skis, although the current owner uses them for more storage. One of the chief reasons that Mangusta has such an incredibly loyal client base though, is that they give speed lovers exactly what they want. To move a vessel that is as long as a Boeing 737 through the water at 32 knots, which by the way is almost 37 miles per hour, takes a considerable amount of power. The builders of this yacht, Over Marine, equipped her with two engines of 2,775 horsepower each. But they connected this drivetrain to K Miwa water jets to really put every hoof of that horsepower to the greatest of effect. Pushing the yacht through the water at great speed is one thing though. Making sure that the guests on board enjoy the ride is quite another. And Over Marine's hull design twinned with the remarkable measures that the shipyard takes in sound and vibration studies, makes for a ride that is exciting, but never frightening. An exhilarating experience that is the result of buying a yacht from one of the yachting's most experienced performance super yacht builders. And talking of buying a yacht, neoprene is in fact available for sale and I and my extremely knowledgeable and very conscientious colleague, Ed Dickinson, represent the owner. So our email addresses will show on screen in a few moments so that qualified buyers can contact us for more information. It is quite an interesting opportunity because the yacht has been upgraded and improved continually during its lifetime. You think about a yacht that you can just turn the key and go, well with neoprene, turn up with your toothbrush and a few clothes and she really is ready to start cruising. She's, she's a biker chick with an attitude that's a lot of fun to hang out with and I have to say, turning up in the Bay of Monaco has been quite an experience. It's full of much larger yachts, but on neoprene, you can't help thinking that you are on the coolest yacht in town. Yeah, this right here for...